हेलो फ्रेंड्स हम लोग शुरू करने जा रहे हैं एन की सीरीज़ मैथमेटिक्स की उम्मीद करता हूँ आप लोगों को इंटरेस्टिंग लगेगी ये उन्हीं सभी बच्चों के लिए है जो फर्स्ट क्लास से एन को रिवाइज़ करना चाह रहे हैं फिर से एक बार और साथ साथ में उन पेरेंट्स के लिए भी हेल्प करेगा जो पेरेंट्स अपने बच्चों को पढ़ाते हैं घर पर और लेकिन उनके बच्चे ठीक से नहीं पढ़ पाते हैं तो ये वीडियो जो है ये बहुत ज़्यादा इन्फॉर्मेटिव रहेगी उन लोगों के लिए तो चैनल को सब्सक्राइब करें और वीडियो को लाइक करना ना भूलें चलिए शुरू करते हैं Number one, Chapter One, Finding the Furry Cat. Let us sing. Looking, 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 looking for my furry cat. Are you sitting on the window shed? Are you sleeping under my bed? Where are you, my furry cat? Looking, 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 looking for my furry cat. Are you inside the backpack? Are you outside the red rack? Where are you, my furry cat? In the first picture, we can observe three children running after a cat. The cat is going inside a house. There is also a cow here, which is drinking water. In the second picture, there is a cat sitting on the window shed and looking towards a bird. In the third picture. A child is looking under the bed. In the fourth picture, a child is looking inside the backpack. In the fifth picture, we can observe a cat sitting on a table. Page number two. Come, 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 come to me, my furry cat. Saw you scratching the bottom of my jar. Saw you playing at the top of my car. Come to me, my furry cat. Come, 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 come to me, my furry cat. Saw you hopping above the hat. Saw you hiding below the mat. Here comes my furry cat. In the sixth picture, we can observe a cat scratching the bottom of a jar. In the seventh picture, we can observe a cat sitting on top of a car. In the eighth picture, a cat is sitting on the top of a hat. In the ninth picture, a cat is hiding under the mat. And in the tenth picture, a boy is playing with the cat. Read aloud the poem. Ask children to recite and enact it. Children can look at the pictures and tell what all they see and discuss the things which are above. below on under and so on with the class encourage them to talk about the animals they observe around them like cats dogs cows etc page number 3 look at the pictures of the poem and encircle the correct word a the red ball is above or under or on the bed under has been circled here as an example b the cat is inside or outside or on the car c the man is lying under or inside or on the tree d the cow is inside or top off or outside the house think and answer a where do you put your shoes inside or outside the room b where do you throw the garbage inside or outside of the dustbin let us play find the things children can divide themselves into two teams one team will hide a few things like white chalk red ball and other items and ask the other team to find them they will give verbal instructions to find the things using positional words like inside or outside far or near above or below etc for example one 
Look for a white thing which is hidden near the board and under the table. Two. Look for a red thing which is outside the classroom and under the tree. Here on page number three, there is a picture given of a boy who is trying to hide a piece of a chalk under the table. Page number four. Let us play. Throw the ball. Each child aims to throw the ball inside the basket. When the ball goes inside, other children will say in and when it goes outside the basket, they say out. There is a picture given here. Few children are trying to throw ball inside a basket. Let us do. A. Take right the things which are inside. Here on page number four, there is a picture of a basket full of flowers. And also there are flowers outside the basket. There are two circles given as well to tick the right and wrong. Again on the same page, there is a picture of a man talking over a mobile. And a girl sitting inside a car. Again there are two circles given to tick right and wrong. Activity should be conducted in a manner so that all the children are engaged irrespective of their differential abilities. For example, a ghunguru can be attached to the ball and surface of the basket can be made different from the surface outside in order to get specific sound when the ball is in or out of the basket. Page number five. B. Take right the things which are outside. Here on page number five, there is a picture of two bears, one sitting inside the cave and second outside the cave. Again on the same page, there is a picture of some toys. Few toys are kept inside the cardboard box and few are kept outside the box. C. Observe the picture and tick the correct words. 1. A boy is sitting on or under the tree. 2. Birds are on or under the tree. Here we have a picture. There is a boy sitting next to a tree. On the tree there are three birds. We can also observe few cows which are walking in the forest. D. Draw a smile below the nose and draw the eyebrows above the eyes. There is a drawing given on page number five where you have to draw a smile and the eyebrows above the eyes. Page number six. Look at our national flag, also known as Tiranga. How many colors are there? Tick right for the correct option. 1. Which color is at the top of the tiranga? White or saffron or green? 2. Which color is below the white color in the tiranga? Pink or saffron or green? 3. Which color is above the green color in the tiranga? White or saffron or yellow? 4. Where is the Ashok Chakra on the Tiranga? On a corner or in the middle or on a side? There is also a picture given here. There are two adults and four children in the picture. They are all saluting to the Tiranga. Few birds are also there who are singing the national anthem. Discuss with children when, where and why do we hoist the national flag. Let the children express their feelings about the national celebrations. Ask children to make their own tiranga and sing the national anthem in standing position facing the tiranga. Page number 7 Chuk Chuk goes our train. Chuk 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 goes our train over the hills and down the plains.
Chuk 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 goes our train. Bogies before my bogey, bogies after my bogey. Make a chain over the rivers and in the rain. Chuk 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 goes our train. There is a picture given here. A train is traveling in the middle of the forest. Are there after the engine? B. How many bogies are there before red bogie? C. Fill the orange color in the bogies after the red bogie. D. Fill the blue color in the bogies before the red bogie. Ask children to share experiences of their train journey. Children who have never traveled by train may ask questions about the journey. Let there be a discussion on what a train is. Ask them to draw a train on the paper or they can make a train by using waste materials like used boxes or cans. Page number eight. Let us play. Children will sing the rhyme and play, a game where they all will form a train by holding each other's shoulders. Everyone will tell who is before and after each child in the train. Here goes our train. Here goes our train. No one is before me and Mira after me. Here we have a picture. Five children have formed a train and they are running together in the middle of forest. They are all singing this rhyme. Suwali and Rohit are making some groups of objects. Suwali, I have put all the pebbles together. Rohit says, I have put all the leaves in one group and chalk pieces in another. There is a picture given here on page number 8 where Suwali and Rohit are trying to make groups of some objects. Let the children do similar activities of sorting with concrete objects like seeds, leaves, beads, etc. Page number 9. Let us do. Suwali has placed all the buttons in three groups. Here on page number 9, there are some drawings given of some buttons and Suwali is trying to make groups of these objects. Why did Suwali make such groups? Help Suwali to sort these buttons in other ways by drawing them. There has been given a blank box here. You will draw the buttons and sort them in this box. Project Work Ask children to arrange the cupboard in the classroom. Ask them to put objects using positional vocabulary like put two objects in the bottom rack, one object in the top rack, etc. तो ये था हमारा एन का क्लास फर्स्ट का चैप्टर उम्मीद करता हूँ कि जो पेरेंट्स अपने बच्चों के साथ ये वीडियो देख रहे हैं उनको बहुत ही इन्फॉर्मेटिव रहा होगा बच्चों को सीखने में हेल्प मिली होगी आप भी ये एक्टिविटी अपने घर पे करा सकते हैं बच्चों का आंसर्स वगैरह चेक कर सकते हैं उनको हेल्प दे सकते हैं और उनके लर्निंग एबिलिटी को इनक्रीज़ कर सकते हैं और आगे फर्दर वीडियो देखने के लिए इस चैनल को सब्सक्राइब करें और इस वीडियो को लाइक करके ज़्यादा से ज़्यादा लोगों को शेयर करें Thank you. Keep studying.